to Dr. Uh, Akhilesh uh, Devendra, I bring in all the wishes and greetings from the entire faculty team and the team of Speed Medical Institute to you for scoring uh, such an wonderful rank and a great performance uh, in NEET SS 2021 session uh, in the specialty of MCH Surgical Gastroenterology. Thank you. Thank you so much. Congratulations. And uh, can we know uh, medical history and uh, medical career where you started till now and we can have a, can you have a brief on that? Yeah, I'm from uh, Hyderabad. I did my uh, bachelor's MBBS from CMC Vellore. And then uh, I, uh, I did my MS general surgery from Maulana Azad Medical College, Delhi. So after that, uh, I wrote this neat exam and uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm thrilled that I could get, get a rank like this. So when did you finish in uh, MAMC? I finished last July, sir. 21 July? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, five months back. Yeah, five months ago. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. And it's your first attempt? Yeah, it's my first attempt. Great. Now, um, did you start after you finish your uh, post-graduation or even you started even before that? Can we know uh, when did you start? How did you prepare to reach this rank? So, uh, in this time, I decided to take the speed uh, coaching app and, and start listening to videos. So, there were three sets of surgical gastroenterology videos that were uploaded progressively. So uh, the first set I watched, and then I watched the second, and then I watched the, the, the final one before before my uh, uh, NEET exam. So each time uh, I would watch the set of videos, it would take approximately two months to complete uh, the entire syllabus. And then I, I'd made notes. So I used to read them, and and only later, like like few months before, like two, three months before, I started reading Bailey and Sabiston seriously. Until then, I enjoyed reading surgical gastro. My, my main intention was to, to read and to understand uh, gastroenterology as much as possible. It's not with the intention to get into NEAT or something, but just to uh, update myself and know, know the subject. So, you, uh, do you also attend live classes? Yes. Uh, no, I could not attend live classes because we were involved in work and it was not possible all the time and after after completing my ms i joined cmc velour again so i was i was working even during this time but i, I had gotten time in the evenings when, when work was over or in certain on certain days that was when i continued to watch the videos so i could not attend the live classes but i was very happy that the classes were there uploaded okay then see you have gone through all the modules uh, and yes, uh, yeah and uh, what, what difference it makes to go through all the three modules? Um, I, the final module especially, I like the fact that it was taken in an MCQ format, meaning you, you put a question and then you discuss the salient features of that particular topic. That was one. Second, I like the fact that management was really stressed on rather than uh, a rote memory of saying these are the facts and you need to know. Because uh, a lot of questions in aims as as before and even in need it was based on how would you manage this patient now rather than what is this what is that so i like the fact that management was really stretched on was taken by faculty who who were a part of the system who knew how to what were they doing in the wards and what is the current guidelines so that really helped me it's also helping me in my in my I, i've already joined as a senior resident in hepatobiliary surgery here is helping me also to to be able to see patients and understand what they what they have so because uh, many of uh, students used to ask when they enroll why same set of videos are loaded in three different sessions and uh, yeah. and and i'll tell them they are not the same uh, they are for yeah. uh, different purposes and uh, i mean as you go through you, you will understand that's the reason why i put across this uh, question to you yeah yeah, sometimes sometimes it's not possible that one set of videos you'll grasp everything. When you keep listening to these videos, every clinician has their own way of conveying how they manage a patient. And no, you'll you'll understand the I felt an overall picture of how things are done, and it made me uh, remember things better too. And I think they would have given you a broader perspective of a complete uh, knowledge base of uh, uh, surgical gastro. <laughs> That, that's true. That's true. Sometimes I'm surprised at how much uh, I, have, I have remembered or learned in this, uh, in this process. I always feel more than this exam now, as you rightly said, 
now you enter the surgical gastro now you will feel the importance of what you have learned so far definitely 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 and that's going to have a greater impact i feel that's what a lot of mm. students last year in 2020 they join uh, through neat and uh, institute exams they say sir even now we go through those uh, uh, videos videos it becomes more relevant now for us they say it becomes more relevant now yeah. at the point of time your focus was to give an mcq and pass but now we feel it is very necessary uh, to correlate with the clinical aspect of yeah definitely definitely i prepared my notes and uh, i keep try to keep going through them so that i understand and remember what what i have written down there's so much i have written down and it's uh, it's exhausting sometimes but it is it is i'm happy that i have this as a backup any time yes yes and that you can keep updating as you go on and that can use for your final final year mch for giving a theory yeah, exam yeah. definitely sir definitely yeah definitely. so great and great uh, to know and how many questions did you attend in this uh, exam i uh, i attempted out of 100 i attempted 95 i left one in uh, the the core paper and four in the general paper excellent and it's really uh, nice to know uh, that uh, your uh, uh, preparation strategy has made you to come li- come quick b- to back to back finishing your uh, general surgery back into mch with yeah. a very short time also, span i mean more than that i also like the fact how you took uh, uh, how you prepared questions based on bailey based on savist and based on tables and sometimes these help in quick revision especially urology it's such a broad topic sometimes i just went through the mcqs to cover portions rather than you know go back to the textbook see what i have underlined or what i have made you know so just going through the mcqs i know okay these are the important topics probably i should remember these so that gave me confidence to okay i'm able to remember them i converted the paragraph of books into mcqs and the entire book i yes. just made reverse so that uh, yes. when they work on this mcq it will be topic wise only even though i made mcqs yeah. yeah. it will be topic wise so that um, when they go through that it will give them a completion of what they want to learn from that chapter in that book probably they'll be able to revise quickly and, yes. and the whole idea was to put really it in a powerpoint yeah so that yeah. they can scroll fast yeah yeah it really helped me there, there were presentations there were videos so students can decide how they want to do it sometimes when i'm traveling it's better to listen to videos sometimes you know you're sitting and you don't have so much time just go through the presentation so there was a complete set. sometimes you want to take tests you want to test yourself that was also available so i would say students had the opportunity to test themselves to study to to not waste time and and this was very helpful in that great and and i mean whatever the work we have done in the back and we we have really doubt whether students will be able to appreciate this or not but listening to you in an interview like this then uh, i mean uh, it makes sense uh, for us what yes. <laughs> you know sometimes sometimes the app is so exhaustive in the sense you can do so much more i could oh, I, i could have done those things also but it's not possible sometimes when when time is limited but i try to do as much as i can yeah because the learning material and tool has to be exhaustive and the students should choose what they want and that's how it has to be and we should never give a completion like a textbook and they should keep on exploring I mean, that's the reason why still now we are already again starting the class now there are so much of content in the app already now again we start the class to just keep engaging them and keep uploading things i always believe in that there should be daily uploads of uh, videos uploads of uh, material and test keep uploading one that will create interest and people should keep working on that fine now yeah. now yeah. what will, what will be your uh, uh, message before the message and uh, and where uh, you are planning to uh, i like i, I like velor cmc velor hepatobiliary surgery i'm thinking i would put this as my first choice and uh, I, i think everything is going according to your plan i i hope to i hope to get in i've already joined some time ago i like the place and i like uh, the opportunity here so yes it's a great and it's a very great institute and, uh, and definitely uh, yeah. surgical training and there will be you know, yeah. we do not say <laughs> it yeah. is and more than that even during covid pandemic I, f- i feel how they manage patients and how they isolate or separate covid and non covid how they continue providing surgical services and so that that really i think is important for hospitals to see how they can continue medical care even in spite of covid waves coming 
and sometimes it does not happen in government centers so, so that was something which uh, really affected me while at delhi and a brief presentation from you and we want to uh, uh, take a message from you for uh, uh, the future aspirants of uh, mch surgical gastro i think i felt this time uh, the 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 uh, the neat paper was mainly based on applications and so they were not directly picked from bailey or sabeskin as questions there were some questions like that meaning you reading something it comes like that so understanding uh, an overall uh, view of how to manage uh, patients in surgical gastro is very important and sometimes we are not able to get that exposure in ms level so watching these videos will really help you understand how to manage them one second sometimes most of these questions especially in general surgery it's very difficult to to uh, guess them in a the sense they are something new there are questions which i have never heard before how do you guess the correct answer so you have to do a lot of questions you have to keep guessing you have to keep testing yourself whether you can guess answers which if you do not know them so and that will increase your chance of getting a better rank i think we able to de- do these two I mean do a lot of questions and keep listening to videos understand how to manage i think that would really help great now time to thank and uh, I mean who made your career so far you can i first like to uh, thank uh, thank you sir and thank you for organizing in such a such a clear way of how uh, you know it's making easy for us to to get into this and that is that is really useful especially when we're all at, at this age i feel i'm not like you know 18 year old i have all the time i'm not distracted by anything else and now i have to work i have to take care of other things too so to have a platform where you can listen to videos and and study on the go i really need to thank you for putting this up and it really helped me personally help my friends too a lot of my friends also views and able to clear second uh, i want to um, i would say thank mamc thank cmc for the faculty for for trying to inspire us to keep studying and and also cmc right now because they given me time also to prepare while i was at work i want to thank my parents they were uh, they were kind to let me choose what i want in life all the time so thank you for that great great talking to you in the morning sunday morning yes, yes, thank you so much and uh, i wish you uh, a great course uh, in cmc vellore and also thank you and as a great uh, surgical gastroenterologist in years to come and to contribute a lot to the speciality itself and also thank for you. the patients who are going to come for your services and you could touch thank you. thousands lakhs and millions and into your career of your surgical gastro and uh, you're going to do great for all that advanced wishes congratulations and all the best thank and all you. the success for all your endeavors that are going to engage from now on wish you all the best thank you thank you thank you bye